Emmanuel Ikubeze speaks on his pet project. With his crown as Mr. Nigeria 2015, Emmanuel Ikubeze, who is currently playing the role of Femi in the ongoing Sugar series, opened up on his pet project. Yeah, Emmanuel, um, I, I'm launching my foundation in, um, in November. I'm doing a project called uh, Project Raw, which is on domestic violence against women. It's my personal pet project. All of this has been inspired basically by Sugar. You know, being part of a wonderful project like Sugar really inspired me to really start up my own um, sh champion or start up my own pet project, you know, that I think would impact in um, impact in people's lives. You know, I will cause people to be able to change, you know, and begin to change their values, you know, how they treat women, you know, basically, and that's why I'm doing Project Raw. You know, so yeah, that's it. I've been working, I've been doing a lot of movies and all of that. A couple of movies coming up. I, I, I just finished filming about a month ago with Akim K. Kazim of Hollywood. So it's really going to be big. It's really going to be huge. So yeah, definitely. You can do this, okay? You can do this. Um, it's just been, it's basically, it's been my work. It's been movie hosting events and um, definitely my pet project. You know, these are the things that I've really been um, um, concentrating on at the moment. And more? Um, basically, I intend to go to a couple of schools, you know, and, you know, see how I can just, you know, give a speech to inspire some of them. Really nothing, nothing seriously planned out. Last year, I dropped a, I released a picture where I just um, brought together the three major tribes of Nigeria and I did a photo shoot. You know, and um, yeah, I just spread it out, you know, to show that as Nigerians, we're one, but we show love. You know, we're, we're, we have different tribes, but we're all one, you know, basically. Here is Nigerian based artist in Ireland, Slim Nani. Watch out his upcoming video. I see Slimmy Day as Yeah. Oh, what a feeling, oh, what a feeling, uh, oh, what a feeling that me feeling. Nollywood Worldwide Entertainment in conjunction with Galaxy Television and Fashion Designers Association of Nigeria for Dan presents Glam Collection 2015. It's all about models strutting the runway, glamorous designs, comedy and musical performances. What's up my people? My name is Oluwa Juna, the comic J1 and you already know what it is. I'm going to be at the Nigeria Television Fashion Show NTFS on October 18. You already know what it is. We're still making money this year. Oh my damn thing. Oh to one bank. Oh yeah, give her money. Huh? Date, October 18, 2015. Venue, Yard 158, Goodyear Abuela Way, Oregon, Lagos. Red carpet starts for 2 p.m. Models hit the runway by 3 p.m. Your hosts, Teddy Dan Momo and Galaxy Television Uche Okaba. Invites can be picked up at Galaxy Television, 25 Community Road, Off Allen Avenue, Ikeja, Lagos. And Platinum Apartment and Suits, 5B Michael Ogun Street, GRA, Lagos. For inquiries, please call. This event is strictly by invitation and proudly supported by the Nigerian Television Fashion Show, taking the fashion industry to the next level. Sanjay's biopic to be co-produced by his own production house. Bollywood's controversial actor who has been in news of late for serving his five years jail term after being convicted for his involvement in 1993 Mumbai Blast has again grabbed the media attention. According to the sources, he will co-produce his biopic film with popular filmmaker Vidu Vinod Chopra and director Rajkumar Hirani. If sources are to be believed, the decision that Sanjay will be co-producing the movie has been taken recently. Sanjay's biopic, which is yet to be titled, will see Rambert Kapu as a lead who will portray Sanjay's character in his life full of ups and downs. The movie will not only present the gray shades of his life but also his stardom days. Director Rajkumar Hirani, who himself is working on the script along with Abhijat Joshi, had admitted earlier that he wants to portray Sanjay's life with all his flaws. With his statement, fans believe that the movie will be full of twists, turns and lots of drama for sure. Where this biopic will see a completely different avatar of Rambert Kapu, and it will surely give an adrenaline rush to both Sanjay and Rambert fans. <music> Doc Brown returns for back to the future anniversary.
Back to the Future's Christopher Lloyd has returned as inventor Doc Brown to celebrate the date on which he and Marty McFly first arrived in the future. Lloyd has made the short film Doc Brown Saves the World, marking the 1985 film's end date of 21 October 2015. Universal has released a teaser for it to be included in the 30th anniversary reissue of the full Back to Future trilogy. Michael J. Fox, who played student Marty, does not feature in the teaser. Lloyd's eccentric time-traveling inventor, Emmett Doc Brown, is seen getting out of the film's now legendary DeLorean time machine sports car. What then goes on to unfold is left for fans to conjecture in true teaser style. Earlier this year, Lloyd also reprised the role in another teaser, this time for the video game Legal Dimensions.